I wonder what CP I am. Smoke weed every day. Hello boys and girls and today I'm going to be showing you how to make bear pussy. Now there's only three ways to get girls. You either have to be good looking, funny or rich. Fortunately for me, I am all three of those things. Now in this video I'm not going to be showing you how to be good looking or funny. But what I will show you how to do is how to get rich. And if you get rich you can actually pay people to make you good looking and funny. And who said money can't buy you happiness? Whoever said that was clearly poor and misinformed. So if you've clicked on this video, you're either new to ESO and need money, or you're an ESO veteran running out of things to do and you need money to buy drugs, skooma and prostitutes. Or you're somewhere in between and probably need money to upgrade your armour and sets and things like that. Now, of course, there are many ways to earn money in Elder Scrolls Online. However, most of them are very long-winded and take a lot of time and commitment. And my one is no different. However, you can get money significantly quicker. You could probably earn around about 80k an hour, which, you know, is pretty good. One thing I would suggest doing before you get into this is speaking to the bag space guy and you know spending a bit of dollar on increasing your bag space. Just think of it as an investment. Another thing I would suggest doing is buying the merchant from the crown store. Now she costs fucking loads of money so I don't blame you if you don't buy her because she can't even repair your fucking armour. But if you're lazy like me and can't be bothered to keep going back and forwards to a merchant then it could be worth it. Okay. So, I know if you're watching this video, you're more than likely going to be poor, which is fine. We all hit rock bottom every now and then. But if you watch my XP tutorial video, you'll see that I taught you how to make friends in ESO, which is going to become very handy. What you're going to need to do is pretend to like a crafter. They're very few and far between because it takes a lot of commitment to be a crafter and I imagine that if you are a crafter you get knee deep in pussy every day. But anyway as I said you're going to want to find a crafter and you're going to want them to craft you some prosperous gear. It can be any set that you want it's just prosperous is the armor trait which just means you're going to be raking in even more money. So when you've lied to that crafter about how much you like them and they've given you your gear you're gonna want to head up to the top left corner of reaper's march here you're gonna find a public dungeon called the vile manse now it says that this is a public dungeon but i'm pretty sure this is a dungeon that fritzel made and when we get in you'll see why okay so when you get in you're gonna want to head your broke ass upstairs and there should be a mission that you need to start now, I've already started mine because I'm a loose cannon. Basically, all you're going to need to do is read this journal, then head on over to these pair of boots and take a key that's hidden inside. And then you're going to want to jump back downstairs and go through to the cellar. In here is where you're going to make all the money. You may as well call yourselves Floyd Money Mayweather or Donald Trump. It's up to you. What you're going to want to do is speak to Fritzl's wife there on the floor and just start killing the ads when you've done that. You know, she might need rescuing or whatever, but she's not going to pay you for it. Money buys happiness, as I said earlier. So yeah, like I say, start going ham on all these ads. And as you've got all of your prosperous gear on, they're going to drop absolutely fuck tons of money. You're going to feel like the world's hottest stripper in the world's busiest strip club. And every man in the room is making it rain. Like I said earlier, you're going to be earning around about 80k an hour, which is pretty juicy. And if you want, you can even grind it with your friends too. There's no real route to doing this. You just want to find and kill every ad you see. As you can see, the dungeon's pretty windy. So when you've gathered up quite a bit of items as well as the coins, this is where your bitch merchant comes in handy. So you want to pull her out and then just sell everything to her. Now, it's not a necessity because you earn so much from the ads anyway, but you know, it just helps you get a little bit more. And fairly soon, you're going to be bathing in it. You're going to be rolling around in your big pile of coins, thinking that you've made it. Then you'll spend all your coins on drugs, alcohol, and women. You'll go bankrupt. Your life will hit rock bottom. Your life will turn into a spiraling road of depression. Then you grind for more gold. And then rinse and repeat, it's the best lifestyle to live, trust me. Okay boys, well that's going to be it from me today. I just want to thank you all 
so much because we've just recently hit 5k subscribers and that's fucking insane i'm not greedy but i want to see how much we can grow this channel i know not everybody shares the same sense of humor as i do i'm very edgy those of you that do you're fucking fantastic and i would love to suck your dick someday and if you don't have a dick then I'm sure we can arrange something but I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, remember to leave a like. It really helps out. If the video helped you at all, then leave a like. You should just fucking leave a like anyway, because if you don't, you're a horrible person, and I'm going to assume that you eat babies. And if you want to see more of this kind of stuff, then subscribe. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter and Facebook as well. Links are in the description. And also join our Discord community. It's full of banter and memes. And what more could you want? And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Hold up.